Hey everyone, my name's Andy. My channel's Finding Value. If you like investing in uranium and other very underpriced assets, click subscribe. This is the channel for you. Join our community. If you like this content, give me a thumbs up. Appreciate it. So today we're going to look at weekly candlesticks. So each candlestick is a week in duration. I'm going to look over very long, you know, very long periods to see what the uranium miners look like. And I charted quite a few uranium miners to see if they're breaking out, what they look like uh, on a weekly candlestick basis. So I'm going to jump right into the charting, doing the technical analysis to see if we have any other opportunities that we should be looking at. So here's URNM, and obviously this is a clear break to the upside. Very nice move here. We've got a little bit of a down day, so maybe we'll pull back just a little bit and then head on up. But this is looking fantastic on a weekly basis. Next Gen Energy. Again, this looks absolutely fantastic. It's a clear break to the upside, and it's run a little bit. Do we come back and pull a little back a little bit? Maybe. But it's looking very good. We've, we've broken out. We're above you know, the downtrend lines. And there's not too much resistance. Now, if you draw this over, we're at this peak here. So it's going to pause here for a little bit. And then I think it's going to break and move on higher. Fission Uranium Corp. We're still in this downtrend pattern for fission. We're still in it. So we still have some time to break to the upside of this thing. So we'll give it some time. It's being a laggard. You know, let's let it do laggard things. Can Alaska Uranium, it's still below this big trend line. This is a big boy up here. It's going to work its way up and probably pause at this trend line, just like this here and this here. We've got a lot of resistance up there. Once it breaks it, this thing's going to look fantastic. Now, Blue Sky Uranium, this thing looks fantastic. Fantastic. Cup, handle, a little bit of a breakout coming up. It, it's right on this trend line, but we're right here. Once it breaks this little guy up here. Oh man, this thing's looking very good. Let's zoom in on it. This is what it looks like zoomed in on that on that handle portion right in here. And we've got a break here to the upside and it's just sitting there. I think this looks excellent to enter. Blue Sky looks absolutely excellent right here, if you like Blue Sky. Denison Mines, clear break to the upside here, looking very good. Encore Energy, uh, break to the upside. Is this a, cu a cup and a little handle here? Break up, and then we might, you know, maybe travel sideways a little bit and then move on up, but it looks great. Base load, we're in this upward channel. Uh, we're coming up, hit, it, hit its head on the upward channel, bounced way back on it. We do have a wick on the bottom here, which typically means momentum's going to the upside. I'd like to see what this thing does. Maybe it hugs the upper rail and then breaks to the upside, but that one's looking okay. Uh, it's been extremely volatile recently. <laughs> extremely volatile. Uh, UUUU looks like, fantastic. It broke its downtrend. And now we've got another chart, you know, another pattern here. Broke that, and now we're just back testing it. I think this one looks very good to be entering because it could potentially move on up at quite, you know, could be another cheetah. Could be another cheetah release. Appia Energy, uh, it's right there at the top. Just sitting there with some wicks in the bottom. All this needs is to be pushed over the edge to move to the upside. And I think we'll get gain some traction here. Pure Point Uranium Group, looking excellent here. Broke to the upside. It may be a little bit volatile. Maybe it back tests or something and then move on up. But this one's looking pretty good. I, I like it here. Deep Yellow, putting in the work on the chart pattern. Looks like we'll probably hit this top resistance line here and then we'll have to put some work to get through it the volume is definitely there that's that's coming maybe we punch through this thing very soon but looking good so that's what i've got for uranium on the weekly charts uh, a lot of them look very good they've broken down trends uh you know when you break a big downtrend like this the resistance uh usually isn't there outside of some previous battles that were done so we could move on up pretty good uh, still, it uh, doesn't mean we're just going to go straight up. It just means that the path of least resistance is moving on up. And all we have to do is see how many sellers are there. And looking at some of these companies, you know, they've pulled back to their very strong kind of steep vertical trend lines and they're bouncing off their trend lines. So it's looking very good. So would I be a buyer here? Yes, 
I would be a buyer. I would continue to cost average in. I think on a lot of the charts, it looks like the momentum's turned around. And on a weekly candlestick basis, they look very good. You guys like this type of content? Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. And I appreciate you guys listening. This is Finding Value.